Hello. I haven't done a tutorial in forever. I just used Go Series Edge Tamer by Pantene on my edges. Oh, super -de duper tight. So tight you cut off the circulation. Not really. But you get the points. Then I just kind of pressed on those areas. Make sure I leave it on for at least um, five to ten minutes. So it's going to be on for this tutorial. Okay. So I posted a bun. I did it twice. I did a whole head bun and then I did just the top with the back down. So I'm going to do that one. And sometimes I'm really random with my styles. I just have an idea in my head and I just do it. So I did it with no pins. And someone asked for the tutorial. Sonya asked for the tutorial. I think I got the name right. Um, so I'm going to do that. So we're going to start with some locks in the center. You may have to have a little length to achieve this. So I'm just going to take it. And kind of get it wrapped and tucked. That kind of creates the base of it. And you just wiggle it so that it's centered. Mine looks like it's a little off. All right, so this is just the top one. I'm going to have some locks down in the back. So... I'm going to just start wrapping my locks around. And then I just find a way to tuck it in. And I don't know if it's because my hair is, uh, well, maybe because it's locked, it just kind of stays. Um, It's also nearing retightening, so it stays too. Um, So I did right side and I went back so this time I'm taking this left side and I'm gonna go back tuck that I go in a different direction alternate directions but even the way this is gonna come out it's gonna be a little different than how I did it the first time but it still works all right so I did that side so I'm gonna go back to this side and I'm gonna go back Find a way to tuck it in there. Then I'm going to go this way. Find a way to tuck it in there. And if you have any stick out, just tuck them, tuck them, tuck them, tuck them. All right, so I'm going to take this one. Twist it back around and go in, tuck in. All righty. So I probably have, let me see, two, two more. What I want to do, okay. So I'm going to take this in the front. I want to take it in the back. Okay, I'm going to take this one in the front. And then it tucks in the back. This one's going to go back. And I can bring it up, I can try to bring it down, but I'm probably gonna bring it right up in here. I guess I'm just finding places to tuck it. Finding places to tuck it and you just kind of mold into the look you want. This is the last one I'm doing. I'm bringing it, I'm bringing it back. I 
I'm just gonna find a place to tuck it. All right, that laid a little bit. I do notice that, let me see, I may wanna move that up some. Do, 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 do. Let's see, just make that a little tighter. Cause it was a little too low for how I wanted it to look. It looked a little bit like a hat. So you just adjust it as you see fit. I feel like that needs to go down a little more. So yeah, it's not a super strong hole for my sides, but it lays them down. And then I can move my head, it's still staying. So I'm assuming we gotta have at least medium to long locks to achieve it. Because if your hair doesn't wrap around, you may have to pin it. But because I can wrap mine around, it works. That's pretty much it. You just kind of adjust as you see it looking to make it look exactly how you want it to look. And that's it.